I'm going to share with you some of my favorite go-tos for transitioning from winter to spring. Stay tuned and I will show you exactly which ones you need in your collection for this time. These are some that are signature scent worthy. They can take you throughout the entire year, but I especially love these for transitioning. I think these are great recommendations for you. Tell me what you think. If you happen to find some of your favorites on here, make sure you leave me a comment. If you happen to have your favorite fragrance for this time that I do not mention, also share that with me. Y'all have shared so many of your favorite fragrances that I have fallen in love with, and I am always on the hunt for another good one in my collection. The first one I have for you is one of my favorite fragrances by Lancome. This is La Nuit Tresor Nude. She is vanillic, coconutty, and she is creamy, she is soft, she is delicate, and she just brings about comfort and joy throughout your day. She's not heavy, she's not cloying, and she's gonna give you that perfect elegance, that perfect air of presence, of femininity, and grace. This is La Nuit Tresor Nude. The next one I have for you as my recommendation as we're transitioning is a classic and it's a stunner. This is Tiffany Intense. Tiffany and Company Intense is a fragrance that starts out musky and powdery in the opening, but it dries down so comforting. It is beautifully blended with musk and iris and violet. She is elegant, sophisticated, classy. This is Tiffany Intense by Tiffany and Company. The next one is new to my collection, but I have fallen in love with this. I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and continue to grow my Boucheron collection. Boucheron has always been one of my go-to fragrances for many, many years. I absolutely love the collection they have for men. They're ultra sexy, they're strong and confident and bold, and they bring about a quality to them. Well, the women fragrances do so very well on my skin. They have an outstanding performance. The longevity is there and they create a scent trail. And I love this new one to my collection. This one has been around for a little while, but this one is Place Vendôme by Boucheron. This one has been out for about 10 years, but it is still very present, very modern, very classic and sophisticated. She is sweet, elegant. She has a light citrus. There is a floral and fresh and spicy nature to this that is just right for this time of year. Now, she can be used in the morning or night and can be used all year long. What I love about Place Vendôme is she is sweet and classy, elegant and feminine, and oh so gorgeous. Look how beautiful this bottle is. It is perfect sitting on your fragrance tray. Place Vendôme by Boucheron is another one that I would recommend for this time of year. The next one I have for you is gonna make more of a statement more of you being present. Um, this will leave a scent trail that people will want to follow. This one here is Madison Avenue by Bond number no. nine. She is fruity and floral. She has a little bit of patchouli, but she is definitely more confident, more bold, and she will make a statement anywhere she goes. This is Madison Avenue, Bond number no. nine. Another one I have for you and I recommend for this time of year, this is when it's still going to have some cold weather in the nighttime. Let's say you have colder weather at night and you are needing something that's going to be a little more woody, a little bit more musky and warm and spicy, but not too heavy. This one here is 
by Molten Brown, and this is Suede Oris. This one here is the EDT version, but with Molten Brown fragrances, the EDT really does give you longevity like an EDP would perform. Definitely has a burst of that amber and woodiness to it. It has a very soft and creamy floral. And then there's a little bit of spice to it. But I think this is for those nights when it's a little crisp, it's a little cooler, and it'll help you transition from winter to spring. This one here is Suede Oris by Molten Brown. Next one, I can't live without. I have to have it on my fragrance tray no matter what I'm doing, time of day, where I'm going. I love the way it makes me feel and it is a mood shifter, mood lifter. It brings such comfort. This one here is Hot Couture by Givenchy. This one here is the Eau de Parfum. With this one, She's fruity, she's fresh, she's spicy, but she has a warm and powdery dry down, an elegant, alluring scent. <sighs> I have this one ready to go, ready to transition from winter to spring. This is for date night. This is for when you're going out with your significant other, your person, your partner. This is perfect for those dates that you are out and about and you want something more romantic. You want th something to be more alluring. Hot Couture EDP by Givenchy. And the last one I have for you is ideal for the work environment. It is one that is going to make you feel and smell so beautiful throughout the day but it's not cloying, it's not overpowering, it's just the right amount of scent that you need to carry that beautiful scent you want to smell on yourself and for others. This is Musk Noir Eau de Parfum by Narciso Rodriguez. <sighs> she is clean, she is fresh, she is a light and powdery scent, she's delicate, but there's almond and vanilla that just makes it so creamy, so elegant. I love her so much. This is Must Noir for her Eau de Parfum by Narcisa Rodriguez. All right, everyone. So this is what I'm recommending for now as you transition from winter to spring. Please share with me your ultimate favorites for this time of year. Thank you so much for stopping by and I will definitely see you in the next one. All right. Until next time, remember, as always, with love, anything is possible. Take care, everyone.